Welcome back to RG Geek. Today I have a special video. I'll be unboxing the game vice for the iPad because I've been watching a lot of videos lately of people complaining about not finding 4-3 aspect ratio screens on handhelds, which I've, from what I've seen, they just aren't manufactured. They can't manufacture them in bulk anymore. There's just not enough demand, except for retro gamers. But I was thinking, you know, I've got, I've got a 4-3 screen. It's my iPad. So why not see what can happen if I get a game vice from 2017? Because they don't make these kind of sandwich controllers anymore. I saw one from Razer, but from what I hear, it isn't compatible with iOS, the well, latest iOS, I think 13 doesn't work anymore. So let's unbox this. I got this used or well, refurbished from Poland on eBay. All right, nice. So you see there's a lightning connector here. And there we go. There we go. Nice Xbox or Stadia button layout. And this pad of hundreds of games available. Let's see if these games are still in the store. Oh, this is kind of fascinating. I don't want to break it. Let's see. There we go. So it looks very much like Apple, Apple style packaging. <laughs> nice. And what do we have inside? Attention iPad owners. Nice. Right here. Your gamepad. Your game vice per iPad with iPad with stabilizers that are used in conjunction with, okay, blah, blah, blah. So the funny thing is they had to produce four different kinds of these for four different shaped size iPads, which might be why they're not making them anymore because they're afraid Apple's gonna put with, get another one. Please do not return to retail store. Your customer satisfaction, your complete satisfaction at our goal. All right, maybe I should have more coffee today. A quick start guide. Hold on tight, that's cute. Oh, that's Europe for you. Oh no, more. It's Chinese down there as well. All right. Hold on tight. You're ready for the next level of gaming. Connect. Well, this is really <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, one thing that's missing on these is there's no L3 and R3 buttons, which is unfortunate. That keeps me from playing some of the games on Stadia. I don't even know how well this is going to work on Stadia, but I'm looking forward to trying it out. But I'm most excited about and building and installing RetroArch and trying that out. And I wasn't expecting this for a few more days. Oh, that's French, apparently. C'est cuisine. Yeah, nice. Let's connect this together real quick. But I wasn't expecting this for a few days now, so... Is this how it works? You stretch it? Well, it stretches really, that's really secure. Wow, okay, nice. Look, iPad. I'm gonna show you my code here. And we're in app not installed. All right, let's get this app. GP150, I think it said. Oh, I don't think it's there anymore. Okay, it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> try to get this working. All right, so let's try a game I know works here. We'll try um, Horizon Chase. It's a great game with a controller here. This feels really great. Please log into this account. Oh, okay, great. <laughs> let's see if this works without logging in. Let's get some sound. So I might have to Come down here. One second. Yeah, turn on sound. Nice. All right, touch the start. Oh, it accepted the A button there. All right. I got a bonus there. Oh, let's go back. Oh, Hawaii is nice. I can give a Shout out to Retro Game Corps who's in Hawaii. So I'm sure this looks just like it would where he lives. 
This is amazing, actually. I have to pull it down there and move this out of the way so we can try to get a better view of, of this. It just works. That's good. I've already done this, but let's go. Oh, right, and one stick. Wow, this is cool. It's like having a cheap switch. I got, I snagged this off eBay for 62 euros, but it's usually more. But wow, this is so cool. This would be fun to like just play in bed or going to sleep or something like that. Wow, nice. And obviously retro games are gonna look amazing on this thing once I get that set up. I wasn't expecting this for a few more days, so I didn't have that installed yet. It's a bit of work to get set up. But hey, this is cool. Anyway, you see it works. I'll be fooling around with this a bit, give a bit of a review later. Could this be like the handheld a lot of people are looking for? It could be. Um, all right. Well, like, subscribe if you want to see more about this device and what I'm doing with this, then I'll see you in the next video. All right, later. Turbo! Maybe Russ can tell me in the comments if this actually is what Hawaii looks like. If there's just checkered flags on the streets as you drive down. I'm sure it is, just like it. Get those graphics.